Yeah, boy, what is going on, everybody? My game's back with some more Madden 15 action. And today, we are in week 7, I'm pretty sure. And uh, this game, uh, as you can see, we started out in the middle of the game. I'm sorry, uh, I'm not perfect. Okay, I'm not perfect. I uh, forgot to hit the record button. And uh, I actually got a pick. So that's like the only reason that I'm in this situation in midfield. Uh, I got a pick, and now I'm throwing the ball on the ground. Like a dingus. Uh, this game was uh, actually like really, really good. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure this was the game, but I'm pretty sure this game was really, really good. Uh, good Jack Ham falling for that crap. But Bethay be laying the boom. Bethay just been like, but they like hits really hard. Like he will absolutely destroy you and kill you with a hit it's just that he doesn't force fumbles you know it's like hit sticks this year just really don't force fumbles like i'm trying to go for strips more often because i have a more likely chance of actually getting the ball on the ground instead of hit sticks all the time uh right there that was my fault uh, my fault i uh, forgot to uh i forgot to uh put up qb contains and uh, he actually hits us with a little good post right here to get him into the end zone for the score. Uh, I gotta, I gotta, uh, I gotta really stop returning kicks because I just, I just can't do it. I can't do it. I don't know if it's my fault or my return team's fault. I just can't do it. Right there, I juked a little too late. I think I should have done a little earlier. I bet I would have gotten a lot farther. That pass is awesome. Just just like for in short yardage when you think I'm going to run it, I just do that pass play and it's so effective. Right there we get stuffed at the line. But right there, that play. That play, I, uh, I'm not sure if I'll uh, do this one series called uh, Madden Tips and Tricks and I'll show you guys how to do stuff. I'm still not sure about that. It's just, I don't know, I might do it in, like off seasons and stuff. I'm pretty sure I said that in an earlier vi video. As Olsen picks up the freaking first air, maybe. Went no huddle here because uh, I'm not sure. I think I saw something in the defense that I liked. And uh, right here we just hit a Alshon Jeffrey with a little short 10 yard pass and he gets us in the end zone. Easy piece. Uh, tell me if you guys like the uh, post commentary stuff or did you guys like it when I did. Like the longer videos with uh, the longer videos with live commentary instead of this. So look at look at this! Look at Earl Thomas! Not only does Earl Thomas get the pick, but he breaks a tackle and he gets it to the outside and he is home free, baby. That play really really helped us, but at the same time it really really hurt us because. Just this drive was so clutch by him. This drive was so clutch. He had to get a touchdown. And look at that. I was right on it. I was right. Man, man, really? Man gives Luke Keekly swats when he's supposed to get picks. But oh my god. Oh, that that was so close. That was so close. Whew. And he goes up to it again. And watch this. Watch. He. I thought he got the feet down, but it was ruled incomplete. It was ruled incomplete, and, and it doesn't really matter, really, because he still got the first down. <laughs> but anyways, <laughs> uh, he hits his uh, fullback there for a little completion, which I was surprised because uh, that's Derek Coleman, and I didn't really expect him to do uh, anything or even catch the ball. But, uh, yep, uh, I'm pretty sh I, uh It's the uh, third quarter now. Hit him with a little post route, and I thought I could go over the middle because I saw both safeties come down. And I thought I could just get it right over the middle, but I guess that's not the story. But anyways, I'm pretty sure this is going to be in two parts. Uh, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.